are going to see how a RL78 microcontroller is uh, uh, flashing. Okay, we have a device called uh, RL78 Flash Programmer. Okay, and we have a uh, development kit RL78 NR Dev board. Okay, and uh, uh, for uh, this programmer, we have two connectors one is a USB connector, another one is a burst stick connector. Okay, uh, for USB connector, uh, we can connect this USB cable, and the other side of the USB cable can be connected to your PC. Okay. Once you connect the um, USB cable uh, to your PC, the board will get powered up. Okay, and we have uh, one more connector uh, with the cable, which will be used for connecting the programmer to uh, the target device. Okay, we uh, for connecting this ca uh, uh, cable, we have a uh, header connector over here. Here you can see there is a triangle. Okay. This triangle has to match with the first pin of this board. Okay, this first pin and this triangle has to match. Once you connect this thing to programmer, okay, uh, we can connect this particular um, uh, connectors other side to your RL78 development kit. Okay, again here also we have a triangle over here. Okay, you can see a triangle. This triangle has to match with this. Uh, particular boards uh, first okay so once you connect that particular uh, connector to your board the board will get powered up the LED power LED will be glowed here okay once you connect your programmer to your um, you know, operating system okay uh, we have to first in install the device driver for this particular device Okay, once you can uh, for the first time if you connect your programmer to your uh, operating system, okay, go to your uh, my computer and take the device manager. Okay, in device manager, you can see a uh, device called CP2102 USB to UART bridge controller, and the driver is not installed. Okay, uh, so when you purchase RL78 flash programmer so there will be a CD in that CD this drive, um, particular device driver will be available okay there is an option to update driver over here okay uh, if you take the software con uh, of that CD okay you can see there is a uh, particular software called CP210X underscore VCP underscore Windows this is the driver for Windows okay now if you want to update the driver okay now come to up, uh, browse my computer for the driver software you just uh, navigate it into a particular uh, folder and press the next button the driver will be installed okay once the driver is installed you can see here in uh, device manager uh, it will be coming under port session okay and the code uh, com port number will be allotted for this particular device okay so this it is allotted as com3 in this particular uh, computer okay now we have a uh, cubesuit plus program which is written um, in embedded c in this program we are going to switch on an led uh, with respect to the uh, uh, tactile switch press okay now once you write a code okay you can uh, go to the build session and build your project once you build the project, there will be X file generated in your uh, project folder. There is a uh, pro in the in your project folder there will be a default build folder will be there. Inside that default build folder, you can see a hex file with that project name. Okay. Now you can come to your um, uh, C CD content of your Flash programmer. Inside that you can see a Flash programming software. Once you install that software. You can get a particular software called Renaissance Flash Programmer software. Once you press that, uh, once you install that, press on the icon and uh, this welcome window will come. Now, once uh, this uh, workspace uh, creation is coming, you can select RL78, that is your uh, targeted device, G14. Okay, here in our development kit, we have a device called R5F104BA. Now, Create a sample workspace. 
ओके नाउ प्रेस द नेक्स्ट बटन ओके देर इज ए कम्युनिकेशन इन द फेस आस्किंग नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू यूज आर एल सेवेंटी एट फ्लैश प्रोग्रामर विच इज कनेक्टेड टू ए कॉम्पोर्ट नाउ वी कैन सेलेक्ट द कॉम्पोर्ट इन फ्रॉम द ड्रॉप डाउन मेनू नाउ प्रेस द नेक्स्ट बटन ओके नाउ पवर सप्लाई सेक्शन ऑल्सो विल बी कमिंग नाउ सिंस इट इज प्रोवाइड फ्रॉम यू एस पी यू कैन प्रेस द नेक्स्ट बटन ओके नाउ फुल प्रोजेक्ट सेटिंग इज कमिंग इन द प्रोजेक्ट सेटिंग विंडो नाउ प्रेस द कंप्लीट बटन नाउ यू आर फ्लैश प्रोग्रामर सॉफ्टवेयर इज कॉन्फिगर्ड नाउ यू नीड टू एड हेक्स फाइल टू यूर पर्टिकुलर सॉफ्टवेयर सो यू हैव टू गो टू द क्यूब स्यूट प्लस प्रोग्राम वेर इट इज स्टोर नाउ आफ्टर गोइंग दर यू कैन सेलेक्ट द पर्टिकुलर हेक्स फाइल ओपन दैट पर्टिकुलर हेक्स फाइल then this start button will be enabled okay once the start button is enabled press the start button okay then you can see uh, the corresponding status windows and once the programming is finished you can see there is a auto procedure and and there is a disconnect button also will come if it is a pass all this um, uh, programming uh, procedures are completed successfully okay if it is fail there is a problem in programming or flashing that particular device okay now this section it is passed now you can go and exit the particular um, software now you can come back to your uh, hardware okay now flash programming is finished now i am going to remove this programmer from this development kit now once i remove this uh, the led is off okay now i am going to power up this uh, rl78 development kit uh, with a usb cable okay from pc i can power okay um, there is an option to select usb power if i connect that particular jumper okay this can, this entire rl78 development kit can be powered using a uh, usb power okay now i connect this thing you can see here the power led is gone now i have i have written a code in such a way that when i press a switch okay this uh, corresponding led start blinking okay now you can see if i press this it start blinking okay now this is a simple program which we have written in the cubesuit plus and we have built it and we have generated the hex code and that hex code is flashed using the flash programmer now uh, the code will code is uh, running in the development kit okay again if you want to check whether the uh, uh, programming part is correct or what you can just reset your uh, controller using the re master reset switch okay now i have resetted the uh, board now again if you press the switch the led start blinking now the code is flashed into the rl70 g14 controller thank you